Hello world, my name is Artemis and this is a space for anybody looking to reinvent their life. See, life is a struggle and if we want to reinvent, we need to know who we're up against, who our enemies are. There are definitely many things that come against us and we all get to fight a different battle if we choose to fight it, that is, but that's a whole different story. But there's one common enemy that we all have that com comes against us and that is pleasure. Well, our love of pleasure. You see, the problem is that we tend to make decisions based on how much pleasure we derive from that decision. See, pleasure is a good friend, but a bad master. And there's a fine line between those two concepts that we have to figure out. We have to find out on which side of that line we want to stay, where do we want our energy to go, and in what direction do we want our life to develop in. Way too many of our decisions are made based on what pleasure it'll bring us. Anytime we delay action is because we choose pleasure. And that becomes a problem because it's gratifying, and it's something we want to repeat again. Instead of doing the hard work, we just choose to entertain ourselves and that feels pretty good. So we repeat it again and again instead of taking measures. When we focus not only on our goal, but also on the gratification that it will bring getting to our goal, it's going to be an easier process. There's some big areas in our lives that involve some big pleasures and I know those are the obvious ones and I'm not even talking about those. I think that's that goes without saying. I'm talking about some some of those smaller culprits that might not seem as, as big failures when we do them. I'm not talking about the big things. I, I know those are obvious. Wait, speed bump. There's this guy, I think he's a naval officer. I'll put the link below to his talk. He talks about how, um, how making your bed in the morning is one of the first things you need to do if you want to change the world. So I want to analyze my own life and see what small pleasures I allow to defeat me and to, to make me stray from my purpose. When it comes to pleasure, we are really bad at gauging our dependence on it. We think we've got it under control. We think that that uh, we are we can master our pleasure but the truth is we are very biased about the subject and we really should not be the ones to judge whether what we're doing now with the decision that we're making now is because of pleasure or because of a, a long-term goal so this is an issue that goes back to a very basic question of standards by whose standards are we judging ourselves and who do we measure up to if I and my ideas are the only ones that I take into consideration when I analyze my own life then of course I'm right all the time. If I rely on the standards and the knowledge, the great and vast knowledge of God to judge me and to figure out if what I'm doing is right, to figure out if, my, if it's pleasure that's driving my actions or if it's a higher purpose, that's when I get the true understanding and a true measure of what I'm doing with my life. Hey, thank you for watching. If you're new here, check out this video. It explains a little bit more about what this channel is and what the message is that I'm trying to get across. And also check out some of the other content. If you see anything you like, I'd love to see a thumbs up. If you hate any of my videos, by all means, find that thumbs down button, click it, and let me know why you hated them.